Well, I first had a sublet on uh, the corner of Prince and Mulberry, and uh, yeah, so that was smack in the middle of that part of Little Italy, and my, my windows looked right down on the Ravenite Club. It was that kind of generic, like fake brick kind of face on it, and I knew it was a social club, so I knew it was some kind of criminal thing. But it wasn't, you know, they were always hanging out and they would talk to people going by. Uh, they weren't hiding and wearing masks or anything like that. Well, there, you know, there were usually like some guys in what looked like, you know, they could be on the golf course. And then you'd have one or two guys in suits because they'd been in court, you know. And uh, then later when running suits came in, they, those were very big. At first I remember them wearing, I remember noticing that they wore like hard sole dress shoes, mm. those guys, you know, but later that changed with the track suits and sneakers and boy, later I wouldn't be surprised if they were wearing shorts and flip flops, you know, I don't know, That's but right. it kind of went, but John Gotti went up, but you know, in style. But I remember them kind of descending a bit. I, I was aware of who these people were, and you got used to a certain culture of guys sitting in lawn chairs or kitchen chairs on the sidewalk, usually with a dog, sometimes playing pinochle. You know, it was just a normal thing. Um, the only time I had direct contact really with them was they um, asked me once I came down from my building, I often had a, a 35 millimeter camera. I took a lot of pictures back then. I came down and they said, hey, come over here for a minute, you know? So I crossed the street and they said, so uh, you take a lot of pictures? And I'm like, well, I, I'm a film student. I take some photographs. They said, yeah, we've seen you up in your window, taking pictures from your window. Uh, we'd well, like to ask you not to do that. I was like, oh, okay, I don't want to, you know, I don't want to cause any problem. They're like, yeah, no problem, just don't do it. And there's no problem. You, you understand? I was like, yeah. So I won't take any pictures out my window. And like, That's good. And that was it for an encounter. And after that, they would say, how you doing? They would say something to me. They, they were okay, you know? And that was the only direct thing I had, although I used to watch them and I could identify later like Sammy Gravano and especially Neil Della Croce, he was very tall. I saw Gotti a few times, but Neil Della Croce was very tall and one time I passed him just on the corner and he looked right in my eyes and I don't know if you know that guy, what he looked like, but he had these like, they, they I don't know if they call them invisible eyes or whatever, his eyes were so pale that it was very haunting. Later, I knew who he was, you know, and later I knew who Sammy the Bull was, but at the time they were just guys associated with the Ravenite, with the Gambinos.